I've, I've learned some really cool things that these guys are doing um, and, and that they've gained from these experiences that we've provided them. First of all, Neuro.Math helped me to connect with uh, researchers doing uh, great work. I love this network, I do. I love working with them. It's so interdisciplinary. Neuro.Net's provided great opportunities to network with researchers outside of my immediate field. Being exposed to lots of varieties of research. I think NeuroDevNet just provides really great opportunities to network with other people. I find being a trainee you feel valued as uh, a developing researcher, which doesn't always happen with other organizations. I first became affiliated with the organization through um, the Opportunities Grant. And uh, also the funding uh, NeuroDevNet provided uh, helped me to exclusively uh, focus on my research instead of, uh, say, teaching. Without NeuroDevNet, this research certainly wouldn't have been possible. With NeuroDevNet's help, with the creating the space for neuroethics research, it allows me to, first of all, pursue my passion for public communication and trying to understand how we communicate science, while also providing a very important um, opportunity to explore neurodevelopmental disabilities in the media. And NeuroDevNet helped me to uh, get access uh, to uh, very important data um, without this data, I, I couldn't do my research. I've received so much uh, valuable ethics training. I took part in the NeuroDevNet 101 online course that was offered in the winter of 2012. It's really nice to have the opportunity to uh, be a voice for some of the trainees about where we would like to see NeuroDevNet going in terms of their curriculum for trainees. The workshops that are provided for trainees on how to you know, get your research out there. And with their emphasis on translating research information into practical skills, um, I see myself continuing to kind of bridge that, what I see to be a bit of a gap sometimes between research and having that have an impact on a child's life. Um, I definitely want to do a postdoctoral training. I can go anywhere with this because now I have eye tracking expertise, psychometric expertise, and imaging expertise. As part of my goal um, as I continue in my studies and I, as I eventually become my own clinician is to ensure that um, research that I'm involved in or research that I'm aware of is translated um, so that it is um, it's able to be used and to be, to be capitalized on by these families. Thank you.